friends i am arjit das welcome to edis higher mathematics today i will discuss a question which is given from gate 2014 the question is if the power series summation n equal to 0 to infinity an z plus 3 minus iota whole to the power n converges at phi by and diverges at minus 3 i then the power series option a converges at minus 2 plus phi by iota and diverges at 2 minus 3 iota option b converges at 2 minus 3 iota and diverges at minus 2 plus phi by iota option c converges at both 2 minus 3 iota and minus 2 plus phi by iota and option d diverges at both 2 minus 3 iota and minus 2 plus phi by iota so the question is given from complex analysis and the concept is only for radius of convergence this is very logical problem about radius of convergence so let we solve this problem let at first we assume a radius of convergence for that series let the radius of convergence of that series be let the roc or radius of convergence of the series be capital r then this series be convergent for all z which satisfy this inequality that mean z plus 3 minus i less than capital r now given condition is that it converges for z equal to phi by that mean z equal to phi by satisfies this inequality and this series diverges at minus 3i that means z equal to minus 3i is not satisfy this inequality so if we put z equal to phi by z equal to phi by then we get for z equal to phi by mod of phi by plus 3 minus i we get less than r which gives mod of 3 plus 4i less than r that means root over of 3a square plus 4a square less than r which gives 5 less than r number 1 now also given that the series be divergent for minus 3i z equals to minus 3i so if we put here z equal to minus 3i then this inequality does not hold for the value of z equals to minus 3i now we put for z equal to minus 3i that been minus 3i plus 3 minus i this inequality does not hold so it must be greater than r therefore <coughs> greater than r or greater than equal to r whatever may be that is mod of minus 4i plus 3 greater than equal to r this is nothing but root over of minus 4a whole square 3a square greater than equal to r this gives 5 greater than equal to r and this number 2 now from number 1 and number 2 we together we can write r equal to 5 so we get the radius of convergence of the series of the given series radius of convergence of the given series b 5 now we comes to the option that means the series be convergent for all z satisfying z plus 3 minus i less than 5 what i say the series the given series be convergent for all z satisfying this inequality now we comes to the option option a tells the converges at minus 2 plus 5 by that mean if i put here z equals to minus 2 plus 5 by then if the series is convergent at the point z minus 2 plus 5 by it must be it must be satisfy this inequality so 
so now we put put j equals to minus 2 put j equals to minus 2 plus sorry minus 2 plus 5i minus 2 plus 5i plus 3 minus i that means root over of 1 plus 4i that means root over of 17 which must be less than 1 less than sorry less than 5 therefore we can say that the given series is convergent at the point minus 2 plus 5i this point is convergent at this point the series be convergent now we check at the point j equal to 2 minus 3i if the inequality if the inequality hold for the point j equals to minus 3i then we can say the series is convergent at the point 2 minus 3 at the point j equal to 2 minus 3i now we check put j equal to 2 minus 3i that means 2 minus 3i plus 3 minus i that is root over that is 2 plus 3 5 minus 3 minus 1 minus 4 i eta that means root over of 25 plus 16 which is mostly greater than 5 so this inequality does not hold for the point j equal to minus uh, sorry 2 minus 3 i so the series is divergent at the point at j equal to 2 minus 3i the series be divergent therefore now comes to the option option 1 says the series converges at minus 2 plus 5i and diverges at 2 minus 3i this is the true option and hence the remaining option will be incorrect so thank you friends thank you for watching if you